Welcome back to the channel guys, hope you all had a fantastic day, today is a massive day. We're going to get a guaranteed team of the season, Serie A, which is massive because that's one of my two teams I run and we can, I've got some 36,000 coins, I'm thinking, Jesus Ben, you went learn a lot of coins, we've got a lot of upgrades to show you as well that's already happened. Now, the only player we do not want to see in this guaranteed team of the season, Serie A, is Savage, that middle iconic Savage guy. Just going to tell you because he'll be an untradeable dude because we have previously packed him, which is a massive pullout get it on video also we do not really want Pellegrini just because he's not a usable card and he's the only one in that team of the season I would argue wouldn't be an upgrade so let's get this in I've checked exactly right rating I just had a lot of Liverpool players I don't know why and I'm never going to use them because they're all base golds and the, you'll see why I'm never going to use them because my, my team overall rating now on both teams is like 191 so none of these guys are getting in Mohamed Salah never got to use them but you know it was a good pack to get them in I think it was the pack I got Thomas Muller in I'll use that team of the season, get it rid of it, it's 84 rated, I think I paid like 16k at the start of the game for it, which was a good start of the team of the season. We've also got, I believe, the guaranteed Idovizzi and CSL. Now, none of these guys are probably going to get in my team, even if we get one of the top end players, but because it's an 84 rated squad, you're thinking, yes, yeah, using a 78 in there, it's just for chemistry. And I'm using Bustoff, who I'm grinding sub Minicana again, I'll get him again. Oh, I want this, just 90 plus. I think 90 plus out of this pack would be worth it. Whereas the other car, it's the team, it's the Serie A team of the season we're really hoping for. Well, I'll show you what I mean though. Because this is my threat. Oh, of course, I've got the wrong team equipped. But I'll show you. You'll be surprised at the big improvements we've got. It is huge. Like, of course, um, let's have a look. Could do that. Kula Bali's tradable and same with Handanovic. So even if we get. There's that Savage I packed. And just to prove I packed it. Oh my days, it was good. I only played two games with him. He is fantastic. Worth every coin he's worth. I got Lukaku. Used him a bit. He's okay. He doesn't feel like an 85 rated card, if I'm honest with you guys. That's why he's probably relatively cheap when he was there. We could do with... If I was to pick a card I wanted, there's a Serbi. I bought him, though. Cheap. And then there's this guy here. If I could pick a card, obviously you can see there's a loan in there. I would want Quadrado. Quadrado works for this team, and he would save me spending the coins and getting them later on. But, even if I don't get Quadrado, I will get a Firenze special card. It's only about 80k in there that's Italian, so it gets the Italian links there. Now, well, this guy was cheap at the point of recording. He was 49k, he was fresh. I'm using him, he looks okay. He's better than my smalling I had. If I get any of the centre-backs, I'm going to trade up Koulibaly because he's tradable. I'll get about 40k for him. I'll get like 40k for him. If I get one of the goalkeepers or centre-backs, it's not the end of the world. If I was to pick someone I wanted to get, though... It would be the left back or the right back. So Quadrado or Hernandez. Those are the two that would be massive upgrades. I'm really not wanting any of the attackers. As mad as that is. Because this is a pretty set attack. If I could get Insigne as left mid it would be nice. If I could get whoever the right mid is. I don't know. This guy's tradable too. So if I get him it's just getting another 30k back. I can't. I, he's probably the one I'm saying odds on. I'm probably going to pack. But let's not waste any more time. Let's get into the packs. This is exciting. This is like one of my favourite times of FIFA. Like ever. When you get guaranteed team of the seasons and it's for teams that actually work for your squad, which is huge. Now that's the Serie A one, so we're going to do the Edivisi one. In eight, eight, right, I'm going to change it, 89 plus. 89 plus, where's the drink? Ooh, I always lose a drink chat. Give us something big. Alright, probably Edivisi. I'm mad to be hyped about this. 92, I'm hyped. That looks good to me. 92, I'll take it. I have no idea what his cost is. Getting a 92 for an 84 rated squad. I take I accept, I accept that. He's cheap as chips, but free stuff, free stuff scares me, height scares me, but his actual card's not bad. He's got the same sort of split as Serbi does, so. But apart from that, that's good. I said 90 plus, and I got 90 plus. Now, this is the bits where if there's a god, if there's a god, if there's anything out there, give me left back, right back, or give me just not. And a cam, and not a right mid, and they're not really uh, realistic, not Italian. But come on, please, this is it. This is the moment. This is the moment. I wouldn't mind one of the goalkeepers. I really wouldn't, to be fair. But come on, just not Italian. It's not. Oh, it's Poland. It's the goalkeeper. Uh, Podolski. Oh, what's his name? Szczesny. I respect that. It's 96, right? 95. It upgrades on that handle. Means. That I can, um, this goalkeeper is going to be our goalkeeper for the rest of the game, which is good. And I think he's relatively good. Six foot five, yeah, he's good. He's got a decent weak foot as well. Uh, he's probably cheap as chips, but you know what? I didn't have to pay anything for the pack. I just saved up the players that I pack pulled, and I used some SBC fodder. 
I respect that and you will see what exactly. Let me just check to see why we're doing this. this is, I knew it was going to be something. I knew we weren't going to get a left mid or right mid because that would be too obvious. So what we're going to do is we're going to have to list him up. I'm going to have to sell him for whatever he's worth because we're going to need his coins to get a Florenzi at right back. And then that's my team pretty set, I think, for the time being at least. At least we didn't get one of the bad dogs, put it that way. At least we didn't get, like, Baresi or even a Serbi. The players I bought off the cuff because they were so cheap anyway. Like, at least we didn't get those guys. Uh, where's a handle? And... And it's... He had an, 80, he had an 84 rated. So I, got, I think I got the best goalkeeper, which was good. I think that's good. He's 39, okay. You know what? 39, because he's tradable and I've got enough... I'll list them. I'm also going to be listing Hazard again because I've used Hazard. I'm not interested. I'll, he's good, but he's not amazing. Look how much of an upgrade he is on Courtois, this guy. More everything, right? He is, I'm more everything. He's very good and he gets links. That I respect that. I good. Bumps the rating up to a 192. Wow, I didn't realise I had a 192 now. That's like, what do you think of this Serie A team? You think it's good? I think it's good for a, a free to play account. Just grind the game. I think that's alright, especially when I rock with this city I tied. I went to Asensio, he's untradeable for me, I might as well use that Asensio. He's just a little bit under par to Hazard's gold card, but he's not that under par to Hazard's gold card. Because Let me just have a look, I thought I listed Hazard, but maybe I didn't. Because I want to get the coins in for Hazard, because I'll get the coins for Hazard and Hanandanovic, and then it'll pay for Florenzi, I'll show you in a second. He's 54k Hazard, that's, he's held on a little bit, worth at least. And we got David Blunt, which I respect. So he's 50. I spent 72, but then that was a couple of weeks ago. That was before like team of the season and stuff. So he's 54. But if I put him on for, if I just put 49, he might go for 49. And I'll put down to, let's get him done. Let's get him sold. I want to get these guys sold because I even got, like when you look at my main team, like, I've got David Blunt, who's completely SPC fodder, which is good. Compare him to the 92 Kulabali, so much more dribbling. Like, look at his passing. How good is his passing? Jesus Christ, I didn't even notice that. 94? His high, second high stat, his like, joint high stat is passing. It's just that he's small, bad work rates, and he's not got a good week to it. See, if he had a four-star week to it, he might be worth a bit of money, to be fair to him. But what we're going to be grinding for, and let me show you, because we have the Italian link there. Where is his name? Florenzi, is that how you spell his name? There you go. Now, he, he is got... A Valencia card, and the reason why I can put him into my Serie A side is because I've got Italians to trap him. Now, I'm sure he's under 100. He will be under 100. There's his card there. This is the card I want. This one here. Yep, that kind of bluey one. And let's just have a look. I'll put that up to 20. And I'll... Jesus Christ, man. You think... You think... After all this time, I've got used to the, like how the work the thing's not. I really don't. I'm thinking maybe it's, it's 70. No. I'm going to spend all the money. I'm going to have to spend all all like 80. It's going to be, he's fixed on 80. But then when Hazard sells, I've got 80. Then I've got Handanovic selling. He does he is he that good? I will argue probably not. It's just the links, man. I need him for the links. And you got Quadrado who works perfectly, right? Like quad, where's our by quad? So it's, is how you spell his name? Is it like that? No, is it? Is it literally spelled with a Q? It sounds like quad to me. So, nah, quadrados. It must be cardard away. How do you spell his name, chat? Like it's not gonna go that low enough unless it goes Cavallaro. Nah, how do you spell quadrado's name? I'm like sorry about my dyslexia and all, but Jesus Christ, I'm struggling here. Like, what do you think? Getting David Blunt and Chesney is not the worst it could have been. I could have got a shitty 88 from the CSL League and I could have got whoever that uh, Pellegrini or Barassi guy who I've already got in the team. Like, I don't know. I think we've done well. I would have, like, the odds on us getting anything else, like, actual... What am I looking at here? Come on, where are we at? New players. Yeah, this city has there. Cristiano, 92, 92. I wonder how much. Quadrado's went down to 160. Like, see? 160. And he spells his name by C-U. That's how he spells his name. I don't know why I thought it was the other way. 
Like, Ferlenzi is not as good as that Cordrado card, but let's get real. Not many cards are, and this card's never going to drop below 150, even now when the, he's getting packed a couple of times, and he is excellent. Look at that. That's fantastic. But yeah, he's got bad work rates and stuff. Bad work rates, bad weak foot. But everyone else about him's alright, to be fair. And he would be the better set. He is one of the best right backs, probably. And you would convert him up to a winger, maybe, if you need to, and switch him about. But I'll show you what I mean. Because I think I'm going to wait now until Forenzi comes out. Until, basically, my players sell, and I can then play with him. Because like, this guy's good and all, and he's about 130k. He's not worth it either. There's a reason why I let right backs and left backs in the Serie A cost money. There's not a lot of them. Whereas, let me have a look. Uh, he was Italian. And I can convert it to that way. And he should be the, the third one. There you go. So I do that and he gets the links. See what I mean? He gets the links. That's that's my vision. And I think that's a pretty good team. That's the team got to the level in which I'm happy with it. Look. Chesney. <laughs> I actually didn't realise his card looked like that. Jesus Christ. He's thumb up. Give him like a wink. God, that's trolly. He's going to be... With, that, with those reactions and being six foot five. I feel he's going to be the best goalkeeper I've used this year. Like, I'm using David De Gea because he links perfectly to Piqué and Marciano, which is good. But yeah, guys, I'll see you in the next one, guys. Drop a like, drop a comment. Tell me what your pools are. If you can beat that, I would argue my pools were bang on average. They were okay. They weren't great. They weren't terrible, though. Whereas, let's say if I had got a rubbish whatever league, the rubber, uh, the Edivisie or the CSL league, and then I got this guy again, or if I'd got that Cam who wouldn't have replaced Mkhitaryan because Mkhitaryan's got a bit of weak foot and stuff, it would have just been a disaster. I would have been raging in front of you. But getting Podolski fits in the team, getting somebody that then I can sell to then get raise enough funds to get that right back, I'm up for that. And then we're, then we're just saving the club up for the next ultimate team goal. I'm, not gonna, I'm just going to grind for the free player when it comes to the League 1 SPC. Like team of the season and all that, but I'm wasting too much of your guys' time. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Drop a like, drop a comment. Have a good weekend. Alright, guys, peace.